Hi there, this is Michael with Analytics Buddy. Tired of hunting for actionable analytics data? Analytics Buddy brings the data to you right where it makes the most sense, inside your store admin interface. The data we surface is hard to find, but as you'll see in a bit, all the more interesting and useful. It's super easy to get started and use Analytics Buddy. Note that if you can't or don't want to set up uh, Google Analytics access, this little point in proceeding. For the rest of you, please follow along. So you just log into your store. Click install. So after you install the app, you are asked for your email address. This is to identify your account and to send out automated alerts from time to time. You can unsubscribe from those emails if you wish. Next, you link the Google Analytics view um, to your store. So you click Grant Access to Google Analytics. Hit accept. And now you actually choose the uh, the profile. Done. And that's it. Obviously, you only have to do this once. The first thing Analytics Buddy does is do a quick audit of your Google Analytics setup and data to make sure everything looks good. Some of the red items you may not need, but others you should pay attention to. One thing that is not enabled by default, for example, is related products. So um, just hop over to uh, Google Analytics uh, e-commerce settings and enable that. So this is where you find it. View settings, e-commerce. It's a little bit hidden, but it's off here. You hit edit. Next step. And that's it. So we run the audit every day. So this is not uh, real time. But on the following day, you will see that this turns to green. So now you're ready to use the app. So right now, the app works on product pages and orders. So I'll show you how to get there. Products. So if you look for this um, button up there with the three dots. Click on that. And this basically brings you to the app page. So on product pages, you can see detailed information about revenue, product views, and add to carts. So optimization is a process. An analytics buddy will add automated events that could impact your store, such as the recent mobile algo update by Google. And you can see here um, that little info icon that says Google mobile update. So you can also update, um, I mean, add log entries yourself here. And again, we will um, look for changes over time. So if you, um, say, modify your product pages, see if they had a positive or negative impact. So we'll keep track of this on a per product uh, basis. On order pages, Analytics Buddy shows you data that is otherwise really hard to get. So same thing, three dots, Analytics Buddy. Here are all the products this customer viewed in the 30 days prior to placing this order. Any complementary products that this customer might be interested in? Well, this shows you. There's obviously the product actually bought, which is this one. But maybe this customer is also interested in this other product. So this product 
called Sample Item, was just viewed but not added to cart. We also provide information on related products, also known as people who bought this product also bought this one. Since this is a test store, there's no data here, but you can use this knowledge in a follow-up personalized email campaign. You can also see the session history leading up to the order. This can uncover campaigns that provided valuable assists, but which by default would look like non-converting campaigns in the analytics tool. The converting session for this order, for example, is from an email campaign. But, as you can see, there was a click from an AdWords campaign before that. That's really good to know as you allocate your marketing budget. Well, that's about it for now. We hope you'll give Analytics Buddy a try and uncover hidden gems in your, in your own analytics data. Thanks for listening.